Hi, I'm Chef Frank. This is Proto Cooks, and today we're making pineapple agua fresca. It's so good. What is agua fresca? Agua fresca is a refreshing drink they serve in Mexico. You'll see it in a lot of the markets. You'll see these jugs. There's like maybe 17 or 18 of these jugs filled with different colored liquids. And it's super refreshing. It's super simple. It has three ingredients and anyone can make it. Okay, today we're doing pineapple agua fresca. I have almost uh, three quarts of water, just close to three quarts of water, about two cups of sugar, and a pineapple. This pineapple is a little overripe, and I like it that way. It's a little sweeter that way, okay? I also have everything I need to do this. I have a, a container with a strainer. Uh, if you don't have this type of container, just use a, a iced tea container. I have a glass, I have a stick blender. Now, if you don't have a stick blender, you can use a regular blender. Um, it, you have to blend this up. It's not traditional necessarily to blend it up, but I like it blended and strained. I don't like chunky drinks. I have a knife and a spatula. Okay, so let's get started. Uh, I have my water here. I'm gonna move my glass to the side. I'm gonna put all the sugar, two cups in, okay? Move this out of the way, I'm gonna cut my pineapple. And I'm probably only gonna use about, oh my gosh, it's ugly, but don't worry about it, it'll taste great. Peel it off. So look, it's a little overripe, that's okay. It's gonna be fine. It's overripe because the color is, is kind of getting, uh, it's getting a little translucent. Um, it doesn't mean it's bad, okay? It's, it's, it's actually gonna be really sweet. I didn't pick this pineapple out overripe. I just let it sit for a while on my counter. So I cut all the, 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 the skin off and then I cut it down the middle, okay? And then I cut the core out. I don't really want the core in there. The core is super fibrous. Um, it tastes great, but I don't want it in my drink. Uh, I'm gonna take the brown parts. I'm gonna eat that and do something else with it. So I'm gonna use about half of this pineapple. Uh, and then the rest of it, I'm just gonna chop, kind of do a rough chop with. I'm not too concerned because I'm gonna puree this up. So just like a nice rough chop. I make this throughout the summer, watermelon, strawberries, limes, pretty much whatever fruit, fruit, whatever fruit, whatever fruit you have lying around, fruit. Uh, whatever fruit you have lying around works great, okay? Let me get a towel. Give us a quick wipe. Onto the counter, get my stick blender. And you puree this up. I wanna get this nice and smooth. I want all the pineapple to be totally pureed up. This also helps to incorporate the sugar. So puree it as nice as you can. I usually shut it off, see if anything floats to the top. Usually some flows to the top, you gotta puree it more. Good, give it a tap. I get my other container and I strain it through and make sure I try not to get it all over the place. Uh, so this is gonna make close to a gallon and you're like, oh, I don't need a gallon of agua fresca you will need a gallon of agua fresca, I guarantee it. So I have a little spatula here as well. And with these strainers, you don't have to get in there really, you can just tap it. And if you tap, you get a little splatter out. But if you tap it, this will help push it through. So I keep on push, I keep on letting it go. Tap it. I don't really want any pulp in there. My pulp keeps on coming out at me. Okay, strain, strain, strain. So we keep straining. What's great about this drink is, non-alcoholic, fine. Put lots of ice in it, it's delicious. You wanna put a little rum in here? 
great. You want to put a little tequila in here, even better, okay? Uh, some people like this a little sweeter. Some people like this a little less sweet, and that's totally up to you. I tend to put loads of ice in this. I want lots of ice. Uh, so the ice just acts as not only getting it cold, but the ice also um, waters it down a little. So I make it a little on the sweet side. Um, so I put tons of ice in it. Okay, so there we go. There is some pulp left over. Feed it to the dog. Maybe the dog likes it. You don't need it, okay? It's gone. Okay, and that is our agua fresca. I'm going to put it into a nice jug so you can see what this looks like. Oh, yeah. Look at that. And my beautiful jug. Got my glass, a little bit of ice. Agua fresca, pineapple agua fresca. Um, let me taste. Mm, man, that's good. There it is, pineapple agua fresca. You can make this with so many different summer fruits, pineapple, watermelon, cantaloupe, honeydew, strawberries, cherries, whatever you wanna make it with. I've seen people make it with cucumbers. Absolutely delicious and super refreshing. Booze, no booze. You can freeze it. It probably makes great ice pops. Um, and it's something that once you make it, you'll be addicted to it. I'm Chef Frank. This is Proto Cooks. Like and subscribe. Hit the little bell down below to get notified when I have a new video. This is a pinch of Frank. Happy drinking. <laughs>